But let's kick off with the word of the day, man. Let me get this input switched over. Anyway, let's do the fucking word of the day here. And uh, learn some things, because I'm a big fan of that. <laughs> At work, <laughs> it's so fucking funny, man. Uh, we have, I'm trying to remember exactly the pronunciation, and this is the whole point of this fucking story. It's a fine dining restaurant, Bourbon 72, in uh, Williamsburg, Michigan, inside Bourbon, or, uh, inside Turtle Creek Casino. And it's top fucking notch, man. And uh, there's some, uh, I think... Uh, Traverse City Rest Traverse City Restaurant Week is coming up, and uh, something on the menu is French, and I'm trying to remember it because <laughs> the way that they wrote it on the white, the you know they write all of the uh, uh, let us know all of the menu items and what's in them, and uh, obviously how to pronounce them in this case, and just know everything about what is on the menu. You're supposed to be fucking knowledgeable, <laughs> and. Uh, the way they wrote it on the board is like the uh, the pronunciation rather than the actual spelling. And it's something like pâté de foie de voulier, I think is actually, I think I nailed it, de foie de voulier, something like that. But they don't have the actual like words. It's just like the pronunciation, uh, the phonetic spelling. And I'm like, I need... You need to get me the actual word so I can fucking see it. That's how my brain works. My brain operates, it might sound crazy to some people, is when I input anything, any sort of thoughts or hear people talk to me and, and input words and music and listen to lyrics, I see those words in my brain as like images. It's just like I see the spelling and that's how I comprehend everything. It's just fucking super fast. It's not like it's like chaotic fast. It's not like genius fast or anything like that. But like, uh, 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 I'm like, I need to see the word. I got to comprehend this. You know, they asked me to be a linguist in the army. And it's probably for a reason. I was like, I don't want to do that. I want to jump out of fucking planes. <laughs> the word of the day is orotund. Orotund. Did I say that right? Hmm? Or rotund. Kind of fucking nailed it. Is it like rotund or is it like an oxymoron? And it's like the opposite of rotund. So like rotund is like fat, right? Or uh, round, sort of. So is it, is, or is it, uh, I don't know. What the fuck does it mean? <laughs> O-R-O-T-U-N-D. Click this. It's an adjective. Of the voice or speech characterized by strength, fullness, richness, and clearness. Huh. The fullness and richness is or reminds me of the rotunda thing. Anyway, I'm probably making too much out of that. Of the voice or speech characterized by strength, fullness, richness, and clearness. Oh, let's read on, shall we? More about Oratunda. First recorded in 1785 to 95. Comes from a contraction of the Latin phrase oro rotundo, meaning with round mouth. Uh, <laughs> with round mouth. Fucking means somebody who won't shut the fuck up, Smith. That's you. Uh, the opera singer's orotund vocals soared through the air, enveloping the concert hall in a wave of rich and sonorous melody. It's beautiful sounding. <laughs> Sorry for the slurping. Sometimes I, I don't even realize I do it. And some fucking asshole ex-girlfriend called me out. One that I don't really like. And it's probably one of those reasons. She's like, you fucking slurp your fucking coffee. I'm like, I, that's the way I fucking drink my coffee. You know? I slurp my coffee. And I like to go, ah. <laughs> <laughs> I think I actually remember making that fucking shitty face when uh, she fucking said that. I was just like, Ugh! that's all I like to do, you know? <sighs> Made me feel good to say those words to her. <laughs> oh, the word of the day. What the hell? Everything!